How's it going everybody and welcome back to another news and updates with Rona 47R. Today is August 4th, 2015. It is late at night here at my house. I need to get this thing done so I can go to sleep and wake up at O Dark 100 and go back to work to do it all over again. So let's go ahead and get started clicking on the, uh, the news section of the World of Tanks Xbox Edition website. Uh, we can see that the last time we were together, um, I always like to do that because I want to make sure that we're not missing anything. Uh, I believe it was August 1st. Uh, so that would be, you know, uh, well, by now it's yeah the 4th. So the last time we spoke was talking about Gamescom 2015, uh, the schedule, and it was a dedicated page and so on and so forth. Now, since the last time we spoke, there's only really two postings. One is August 3rd and one is August 4th. So let's go ahead and get started here with the Community Heroes and recap number 28. Now I'm very excited to go ahead and get involved with this one and I'll show you why in just a minute. Uh, let's see here. So going down, you know, it's kind of the usual thing. Uh, you got a tier 10 tanker, uh, ace tanker 420. And it looks like, oh, only 733 kills. So <laughs> pretty awesome. Um, Want to be a streamer? And it says here that there is a guide uh, written by C6C6Dog. I've never heard of that individual before. Interesting. Uh, Twitch streaming quality improvement guide. Very cool. Um, definitely need to take a look at that. And then Abracadabra, what do we see here? While we're on the topic, uh, here's a list of streamers that we have been broadcasting, that have been broadcasting World of Tanks recently. Um, I don't know any of these guys except for, well, I know my good friend Soviet there. Sure. I don't know these dudes. Haven't met them yet. But wait a minute. Is that Wizard Ken? I believe it is. So he's getting some wargaming love finally right there. Um, down below, uh, you can see there's some videos uh, by some folks. And uh, actually, all those guys are in my circle. That's hilarious. And, uh, you know, so Wizard Ken's getting some love here. Finally, if you haven't seen it, check it out. And then, of course, Soviet Death. He's a club war gamer there. We've seen him floating around. Centurion Gaming, known from some very good uh, video stuff. And uh, down below, we've got some Tales of Glory. Uh, some pictures here, some screenshots sent in. And, of course, it says, uh, you know, the reminder to get uh, involved. Now, here's the funny thing. I was just talking to Wizard Ken about this, and and um, I'll just, you know, basically skip to the punchline, which is, um, well, which was part of it. And that is, you know what? I'm always talking about um, getting involved and how, you know, you don't get noticed unless you post. I've been a bad boy. I have not been posting anything for months. And lo and behold... I'm not coming up on this thing. And so what does that tell you? It tells you that I need to start uh, posting on the forums. Now, here's the thing I was thinking about. And I'm going to go ahead and put this out there. I hope you guys are listening. Um, here's an opportunity for you, uh, an, an idea. Uh, basically, let me just back up. So I just started streaming, right? And if you're familiar with streaming, uh, sometimes uh, a YouTuber, a streamer, will go ahead and have someone assist them in modding or being the admin, the person who helps out with the uh, the chat room and that sort of thing, because it's hard to do when you're streaming and you're trying to pay attention to the chat. Well, um, you know, some of us have someone that assists and it's really helpful. Well, here's the thing. I don't always have time to post. I mean, I'm barely having time to get this stuff done, right? Well, I was wondering if folks have been helping me or one individual, Mickey, thank you very much, shout out to you, um, has been helping out um, being the mod for my streaming, well then why couldn't we get some type of mod to help me out with posting on the forums? So here's a thought guys, I'm just throwing it out there. Please contact me. Um, you know, maybe you can uh, post something in the discussion here when this video gets uploaded or you know, maybe you wanna just email me directly. I, I don't care, whatever works for you. But here's my thought, just brainstorming here. Maybe I can get a person or persons that are going to assist me so that every time I'm uploading videos, they can reference it, reference it, um, say whatever they want to say that makes sense as far as, you know, highlighting and bringing uh, attention to the fact that we have some new content in there. So I, I don't know. That's just tip of the iceberg. Just, you know, want to know what you think about that. So I'm planting the seed. Let me know what you think. If there's anybody that wants to help me. Uh, manage my uh, my site there on the uh, through communicating on the forums, you know, be great. Anyways, we can talk more about it later. Clicking back on news. Um, here we go. 
So the only other posting is from today, August 4th, and it's Gamescom 2015, a handy guide to visiting booths. <laughs> I'm sorry, that just kind of sounds funny. Um, for those of you that, you know, have challenges, you know, visiting, uh, visiting booths, this is going to come in very handy for you. So, um, and also, <laughs> so anyways, I mean, it's some, it's, it's good advice. It just sounded funny. I don't mean to put it down. It just sounds funny. Um, uh, because if you've ever been to any type of big convention, name one, you know, Comic-Con, whatever, it is crazy overwhelming. It's controlled chaos. Uh, it's like going to Disneyland and, um, you know, you can't see everything that you want to see. So you kind of have to have a game plan. It, well, assuming you're a nerd like me and you want to actually achieve things that you want to get done. So anyways, they have some, uh, some information here that you can take a look at on how to make the most of your trip to Gamescom. Oh man, that's awesome. Nothing else needs to be said about that. Okay, so going down here, going down here, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna go ahead and click back here on the main website. And um, gosh, I wish I can tell you guys some more because there are some you know little bird things that I am sniffing out, hearing some secret messages going back and forth. Um, there is exciting, this is, we're living in exciting times, guys, and uh, things are a changing. Things are, are continually, Hmm. Evolving. So um, I don't have the complete end result answer, but I just know that things are continuing to evolve and I cannot wait to see what happens. So I'll leave you with that. Um, also to get back to me on your thoughts on uh, assisting me in the forums um, with, uh, you know, working with what we do, because it's not my it's not my YouTube channel. It's our YouTube channel, which is the same thing as our, our streaming. It's all to me, the one and the same. I mean, they're different technically, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Anyways, so uh, get back to me on that. And just another shout out, just because it's such a rarity. I mean, this guy does not get the, uh, the mention that he deserves. Um, if there's a guy, you know, love him, hate him, whatever. If there's one thing that you cannot disagree with, this guy has his heart 100% into World of Tanks and the folks that play it. You know, his subscribers, friends, streamers, put whatever label you want on it, buddies. And we all are that to him. Um, so, you know. It's just nice to see him finally get some get some love there from Wargaming. So good job, Wargaming. And uh, hopefully Wizard can. We will be seeing more of you in situations like this. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and uh, wrap this thing up, upload it, and uh, get this thing released. Meanwhile, I'm trying really hard, I promise, to get the rest of the videos out. I had one successful stream, so that is another news and update piece that is off of the website. Um, but interestingly enough... Um, the the Twitch broke one broadcast into two not the same size chunks of video. I was able to grab one and move it over to YouTube, although I haven't released it yet because I wanted to download it and edit it to make it a little pretty because I don't like just putting raw stuff up there and I'm talking way too much. Um, but the other chunk was like an hour and something and I grabbed it and downloaded it and it was all corrupted. So I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's weird. It's all new to me. I'm doing the best that I can. Um, uh, one last little piece of uh, cable is, uh, for some reason didn't come yet with the shipment that I got, uh, yesterday. And in theory, we will have a complete as I, as I drum my fingers together in a, uh, you know, maniacal way, um, you know, -ha, -ha, ha I think we may have all the pieces in a few days uh, to assemble our recording on Xbox One with the uh, the Astro A40s and that sort of thing. So that's pretty much it. I'm done babbling. Uh, I'm tired and uh, we got to get going on this stuff and I want to continue pumping out some videos to you guys because you deserve it. Remember, if you're receiving this transmission, you are one of the 47 Ronin and I will catch you later. Now, where did my crew go off to? Oh, I see. There they are. Okay, girls, tell them who they are if they're receiving this transmission. You are one of the 47, 47 Ronin. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you later.